Hey guys, Mark here from Promix Academy uh, with a quick one today, really just as a follow up to a previous video I did on sample rates and bit depths. In this video, I want to talk to you a little bit about the three file types that Logic offers for us to record in. So let's jump up to our Logic Pro 10 menu under Preferences and Recording. And under Audio, we'll see that the recording file type is by default set to AIFF, but we also have WAV and CAF formats available. Now this all sounds really confusing already, um, but honestly this is probably one of the shortest videos I'll do uh, because really there's not a lot between especially these two. Um, all of these file formats are what we call lossless formats, which is to say uh, there's no loss of data uh, when recording audio. These two differ very slightly, but uh, the digital information is stored as an exact mathematical representation uh, of a waveform. They both use something called PCM, or pulse code modulation, uh, to encode the data. Uh, in a way that minimizes the loss of quality. Um, really what that means is that all of these will be super high quality audio and you're not going to uh, be lacking in quality by choosing one over another. The downside to that is that they're all really large. Um, that's the nature of audio recording is that the files are large and do require a lot of space. Wave was born first um, to the parents of Microsoft and today is still considered to be the industry standard file format for audio, whereas AIFF was born a few years later uh, and in a way was Apple's answer to the WAV file. So which one do we choose? Well, to be honest with you, uh, it doesn't really matter, especially between these two. Um, the circumstances where you would need to choose the CAF file are pretty extreme. Um, so really, uh, for the purposes of what we do, it's between AIFF and WAVE. Um, according to dummies.com, the only real uh, limiting factor I can, I can find that might influence my decision is that an AIFF file has a four gigabyte lim size limit um, and a recording time limit of between 20 minutes and three hours and 15 minutes. We have a waveform, uh, which, a wave format, sorry, which also has a four gigabyte size limit, um, but has a much longer time limit of between 40 minutes and 13 hours and 30 minutes. CAF, in contrast, has no size limit, which again is why I said uh, the circumstances around choosing that would have to be pretty extreme. Um, however, it is available and you are welcome to use it. I'm generally speaking recording in AIFF, but when it comes to exporting either a production for mixing or if I've mixed something and want to send it off for mastering, I will use WAV formats. Really just because it's an industry standard, but honestly, if I exported it in AIFF, uh, their software would still be able to read it. It is pretty industry standard as well. So that's a nice short and sweet one for you. If you found it helpful, please give us a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe, hit the notifications. We've got content coming out all the time. Uh, if you have any questions, do drop us a comment below. And if you want to take it even more seriously, we've got the Promix Academy details to follow.